Hey modders, it's Rand said. With the anniversary update looming around the corner, we have no time to waste to prevent it from breaking your game. So let's jump right into the requirements. One, you must be running a working modded game. Two, you must have the correct F4SC version for your game. And three, you must have a mod manager already set up. If your game is already broken or the anniversary update has already hit, you need full process for rescuing your game, which I cover in my next downgrade and modding guide. Stay tuned for the upcoming guide by subscribing and check the video description for links and information not covered in the video. First, we'll cover two prevention steps that most guides tell you. First method is changing the update settings for Fallout 4. Go to your Steam library, right click your Fallout 4 properties and click the updates tab. On this drop down, click wait until I launch the game and never allow background downloads. And now the read only method. Navigate to your Steam apps folder. Locate the file named app manifest 377160. Right click it, go to properties and check read only box and hit okay. These common methods only delay the problem as Steam is known for bypassing these settings and updating anyways, which is where my final solution comes in, uninstalling the game. First, close your mod managers and keep them closed. This is mandatory. Go back into Steam, browse local files again. Click the Steam apps slash common folder. Create a new folder called FO4 Backup. Return to your main Fallout 4 directory. Select all your files, cut, and paste them into that new FO4 Backup folder we just made. Copy the fallout4.exe and paste it back into your empty Fallout 4 folder. Go back into your Steam library, right click Fallout 4, manage and uninstall the game. The final step is to rename your FO4 backup folder to Fallout 4. Exactly. And that's it. To see if this worked, all you need to do is launch the game via F4SC in your mod manager. If you accidentally hit play in Steam, you'll simply be prompted to install Fallout 4 instead of a forced update. Not only does this prevent Steam from auto-updating, this method still tracks your in-game hours. If you're interested in more modding guides, like and subscribe to my channel to stay in the loop. And as always, wreak havoc in the wasteland, modders.